Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for September 20th of 2022. Well, it is titled Star Forming Region NGC 3582 without stars. So what do we see here? Well, this is the star forming region, which is known as NGC 3582. And this is also sometimes called the Statue of Liberty Nebula for its vague resemblance, perhaps of a giant statue. And what we see is a, a star forming region in which stars are forming. Uh, but in this image, we see no stars. Now, why is that? Well, the stars have been digitally removed to allow us to focus on the nebula itself. So let's take a look at the nebula with stars. And as we see that we can see that it looks like an ordinary nebula just as we saw before. But if you look at it without stars again, you can see that there's more detail visible that it's a little bit easier to see the fine detail around the nebula when you look at it without stars as compared to looking at it with stars. The stars do lend a distraction. So when you want to study the nebula, you can digitally remove all the stars from the image, therefore allowing you to see it in more detail. Now when stars form within these, we see all of the material from from dying stars as well. So while stars are forming, we know that stars, especially the very young massive stars that form first, do not live a very long time. And some of these shells that we're seeing of material being expelled outward are caused by those dying stars as they push material outward. At the same time, new stars continue to form. So we have a few dozen stars, very massive stars that are around the end of their formation and beginning to form a very young star cluster. So could we come back in a long time, maybe a few hundred thousand years or even a million years, we would have a star cluster here and the nebula that we see would be pushed away. So the nebulae that we see, while very nicely formed here and beautiful looking, do not last as long as the stars. The stars will live for a much longer time and their energy will eventually clear out the nebula. First, they will slowly change the structure and then eventually in the long run, push the material out, leaving just behind just that cluster of stars. So we get to see these nebula nebulae in just a fleeting moment in astronomical time, maybe millions of years before they end up leaving and being dispersed out into space. So that was our picture of the day for September 20th of 2022. It was titled Star Forming Region NGC 3582 without stars. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be horse red nebula. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone. And I will see you in class.